In this video tutorial, students will learn how to navigate their Canvas courses and how to set their personal settings. When you first log into Canvas, you'll notice that you're on the Canvas homepage. The Canvas homepage will show you recent activity in the middle of your screen, and on the far right hand side, it will show you all of the assignments that you have to do and any assignments that are coming up. You can also go into Calendar View uh, to see those assignments as well as click on Calendar View in your top navigation to see assignments as well. Underneath Assignments at the very top is another shortcut to the list of assignments that are due, as well as Grades. You have a shortcut that will take you directly to your courses so that you can see how you are doing in each of your classes. Up in the top right hand corner you will notice your name, your inbox of messages from your course instructor, comments on your assignments, your settings, and your button to log out. Let's start by clicking on our name, Suzy Campus, and on this page I am able to customize a number of settings. The first and probably the most important is to set up the ways that you would prefer to be contacted by your courses. You can be contacted by email address by click, simply clicking Add Email Address and entering the email address that you would like to receive your notifications. The other way that you can uh, be contacted is adding a second contact method. This could be a text message or an SMS message. Just enter your cell number, your carrier, and your SMS email if needed, and make sure that you have a text messaging plan that your parents have approved. Once you've set up your email addresses and your other contact methods, you'll want to go to Notifications. Notifications will let you choose how often you receive communication from your courses. At the very least, we recommend that you get a daily summary by, by mousing over each of the categories and clicking on Daily Summary, the second button that looks like a clock. There are a few areas in which we believe you would want a, um, notifications more regularly, as soon as possible actually, as soon as they're posted by your instructor. One of these would be announcements, grading, and any course invitations that you might want to be invited to, any, any new courses that you've signed up for. I also prefer to turn on submission comments to be as soon as possible as well so that if an instructor has told me that I need to add more content or I need to uh, resubmit an assignment because what I submitted was incomplete, I would want to know that right away. So I'll check ASAP for that. Underneath discussions, we recommend that you just set everything to be daily. and This will provide you with one general email that includes messages from all of these categories. Go through and do the same for scheduling, for groups, and for alerts. Also over in your left-hand navigation, you'll notice a section for files. The files that you can find in this area will be the files that you have uploaded for your courses. These could be images or PowerPoints or Word documents, but it provides easy access to all of your course materials. Under Settings on the home page of your personal settings, you will notice that there are other services. These are services that you can subscribe to to utilize in your courses. For example, if you complete an assignment in Google Docs, you'll want to attach your Google Docs account to your Canvas course so that you can submit a Google Doc assignment. In order to do any of the other services, in order to attach them to your course, you'll click on the service that you want to register You'll click Authorize Google Docs Access and be prompted to allow that service to be connected to your account. The nice thing about Canvas is that it can be customized for how you prefer to submit your assignments.